Breaking news, we have the highest demand in real estate as of today, October 8. What happened to the price? We are going to take a look at that right now. Welcome back everyone to my Monday market update. Today, I am happy to share with you a real estate data that reflects the demand of housing in real estate. Specifically, we are going to look at the change in listings under contract. Uh, and the data is collected by Comfort Market Update, a very reliable real estate data company in Arizona. In front of you right here, a lot of dark, a lot of confusing, I know. And this is the data from 2016 all the way until now, okay? The first thing, this is actually the listing, the change in listing under contract year over year. So every dot that you see represents the change from previous year to the current year. For example, as of today, we have 13.6% change year over year. That means compared to the number of listings under contract as of October of 2024, we have an increase of 13.6% when you compare to October of 2023. That is number one, a positive number, that means is increased, right? There are more people buying houses today compared to October of 2023. The second thing that we recognize is also we for the last for the last four or five weeks we have an increased trend of uh, starting around negative 10 percent a, 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 a slope, a, a go down slope, right? A decreased slope, right? To about negative 5% to about negative 2%, go up positive 3% and positive 5%. So it has go down since six weeks ago. Okay, so that's recognized number two. Lastly, the trending has been, the trend has going up following a very long, very long period in which we have the negative change. Again, the negative change meaning less and less people going under contract. That means less and less people have a demand in buying a house. For the last six weeks, we actually have a trending upward. That means more and more people. And the fact that it is positive 13.6, this show the highest demand in change in, 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 in housing in Arizona, all right? So talking to here, a lot of people may say, hmm, if there is a very high demand like this, it's gonna affect the home price. Yes, it does, okay? However, is it gonna make the home price moves up? The question also, we have, we have to look at the supply as well, because any time that we talk about price, demand is one part of the equation, and the supply is also another important part. Let's take a look at the demand right now with the active listing. Each line right here in front of you represents the active listing for that year. For example, in 2024, this is the year for, uh, this, the blue line is the year for 2024. The pink line is for 2023. And each dot represents the number of active listings for, for the third week, okay? So the man, uh, the, 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 the man person, the man line that we are going to talk about here is the blue line, which is for 2024. First of all, we recognize that it is also trending up, right? It is. It has been the highest compared to 2023, 2022, 2021, and 2020 since the beginning of, maybe since the middle of January, okay? Now, it's also going up. The only competition is 2022, right? But it's about to reach the highest point of 2022 as well. So that also telling us that the number of supply of houses available on the market also going up. So with the demand go up and the supply goes up, we can see that there's not much of pressure on price because 
well, because we don't have any unbalance between the demand and the supply. It's still following the same trend that's going up for both, right? So this is a very interesting situation that we are going to continue to uh, monitor and to see whether which one is losing first, okay? Which one lose first, okay? Either the demand or the supply, because in that situation, uh, will impact the price. And uh, we, I will continue monitor, monitoring those numbers and then show you all the information next week. Uh, thank you so much, everyone. Let me know if you have any question about the, any information about the real estate market. I'm more than happy to share with you the information. Bye-bye.